into your page carbon admin panel the page carbon admin panel could be your local host the one you installed on your system it could be the one on pagecarbon.com anyone okay but it's always good to use one that is blank that doesn't have anything on it like you yeah, have not used it for anything so i could come to my pagecarbon.com create a new site and call it theme dev then i close once it comes up on my list i can now go to the admin panel remember it's the admin panel we want to go to okay so It gives us a step here. Number one, go to your uh, page cap on admin panel. That's what we are going trying to do now. We're trying to open the admin panel. The number two is click on appearance in the menu to the left. It is this one. Sorry, where is it? Uh, where is it? Yep. Yeah, so appearance. Then. Proceed to themes, then upload new theme, right? So we proceed to themes. Then on this, it says upload new theme, right? So I click on upload new theme. Then enter on the screen that pops up. Enter theme name of your choice. This is choice. Um, so what is the theme name? Let it be the same name as the one we downloaded, which is mini blog, right? Mini blog. This is not required, but it's good so that maybe 10 years from now you know where you got your theme from. Do you understand? Then you now upload the uh, the file you just downloaded. You look for it on your this is it right here. The zip file. Okay. So you upload it. Then deliver the theme updates bank. Then you save. The, you leave it the way they are, right? Then you leave all this one the way they are. Then you save. So we are done. Then close the screen. Then the new theme should be listed on the list of things. So it's now here, right? Right? Mm -hmm. So um, now, under the new added theme, within the options, click on preview to confirm that all the components of the theme are displaying correctly. So now, under this particular one, right, there is options. You click on the options, then you click on preview. The preview gives you, we'll try to show, good morning, we'll try to show the theme the way it's supposed to display. So let's see if it will display the right way. You see now, that means it's imported correctly. Okay? It's showing correctly. You can confirm that from everything. It's showing correctly. This is what we want. Which one? Nothing is showing up now. So it's showing correctly. Mm. That means you are done with this part. Right? You have imported successfully. So next is to integrate page carton functions into the because normally you can use the theme like this. Just edit it directly and all. But it's not advisable when you're doing, creating a theme. It's good to to use that theme um, to use it within the page pattern functions. It's always easier to, for management and all that. So let's end this now.